Hey, Dan, you want to be here for this? Oh, come on. Okay, fine. Sorry, guys. And then, nevertheless, hello, everybody. Isaac. Okay, we know this. All right. And welcome back to The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Haven't played this in a long time, or haven't recorded in a long time. I just played up until a certain point here, and I actually had a pretty good run going, or I have a pretty good run going. I'm gonna get right into it. I'm playing as Judas, who starts out with one heart actually, but yeah. So yeah, I got like the I got like small rock and chocolate milk right off the bat, and then I later got big brimstone, and I got something else. I don't know. I got the thing that made you then said like you feel balanced, which. Which, which did nerf my damage a little bit, but still. Now I also I also just got um, uh, what is it called? Lump of coal or whatever it is. So yeah, this is a pretty good run. I honestly I'm just got pretty damn lucky this round. So I'm gonna try to go the other route this time, not the one that I did last time, which is beating Satan. I'm probably not gonna get there in this video. Oh my god, I hate- I forgot about these guys. Dude, I haven't- I haven't played this game in so long, guys. I forgot about how gruesome this game can be. Okay, that- um, I'm gonna use this, actually. Probably could use it for something better. Okay, well, whatever. If I need that later, I'll get it. So I'm gonna try to beat Satan. I'm probably not gonna get there in this video, but- Um, we'll try to make it as close there as we can. So right now, guys, I'm in the apartment, actually. This is my first video in the apartment. Yay. I'm not using my Beats headphones, because I don't have those. They're not- I haven't opened them yet. I haven't unpacked them yet, honestly. So I'm using my regular Apple headphones. It, I don't think it'll sound much different. It shouldn't, but... Oh my god, a almost didn't see those completely. Uh, I hate those things. Oh, I hate these too. Good thing I got little brimstone and everything to help me. Oh, there's a lot of them. Get that heart. <laughs> and also, yeah, I also got, um, what's it called? Death's Touch, which makes, which makes my tears sights and they can, they can penetrate through like enemies and they increase the damage slightly, I think. And just makes the tears kind of bigger, basically. Oh, I lost all my black hearts. But I do have one life, question mark. So I have a chance to re have like a 50-50 chance to respawn after I die, if I die. This will penetrate through your mask too, won't it? Yes, that's awesome. I have a lot of keys too, surprisingly. Oh god, no, I'm not doing that. I don't trust it. Last time I did that in the playthrough, you know what happened. I, I didn't, I got items that were pretty much worse than what I had, in my opinion. Everyone plays the game a little bit differently. For the most part. Oh, God. So this apartment's a lot smaller than my house, so I have to be a little bit more quiet because there's also, because there's people around us and rooms around us. So I have to mind that. So I don't know how I'm going to play sister location without disturbing people, but also disturbing people in my apartment as well, like my mom and dad. They're watching TV just over there, and my sister's like in the room, like right, like really, like with the door open, like right next to me. So everyone can hear what I'm saying pretty much right now, for the most part. That's why I'm being, a, I'm going to try to be a little more quiet while I do these things. It'll be a good challenge. Okay. Let's see, I hope the audio is alright for everybody. If it's not, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry, I gotta move the mouse out of the way. Sorry, guys. Move it to the side. Let's go in here, the item room. Oh, that'll be helpful. I think I'm gonna use that, because my damage is pretty good like it is. Dude, these guys again. Oh, so disgusting, huh? They just give me the heebie-jeebies, I don't know why. Ooh, golden poo. I have a lot of money. Gotta spend it somehow. Maybe that's a shop right there. Hopefully not like a little mini boss fight. Hey, I can jump. Hey, perfect, perfect um, example right there. Oh, how good it is. 
Um, this jar is, that's not very good. This thing, I don't know. That means that has a chance to slow down enemies, but it can also speed it up or something. I don't know. Um, I'm gonna get one of these. Donate a little bit. Oh, it just broke. Seriously, that was the one I put in. I'll get, oh, good. All right. Let's go to the uh, this room, the battle room. Going up, I'm up for the challenge. It's not gonna be much of a challenge since I have really good items. Just got two keys out of that chest. I forgot I should be using little brimstone. Oh, invisible guys. Oh god. Okay, I killed them all in like one thing. Uh, 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 was this worth it? Oh, probably not. Please tell me something good. Oh, blue ones. I don't think it was really worth it. But we'll have to see. There was a point in this playthrough where I didn't have any, any, um, any red hearts because like I got like that that yellow like the yellow like syringe thing the thing that's like that's like that like randoms all like your stats and like everything kind of not your items but everything besides that pretty much I hate those blocks that almost got me time for the boss I'm gonna kill it pretty quickly oh oh maybe not uh this guy's annoying I think he shoots laser beams that are really annoying where did he go oh he does that oh god Yep, that's, that's what I was talking about. I just dodged in time. You can, like, aim it, too, kind of. Okay, he's gonna do the jump thing again, I think. Yep, okay. Get him, he's almost dead. Aha, there we go. Jesus, juice. Damage plus range up damage. <laughs> Let's see how big it is now. And it gets bigger as it goes away, as it gets farther away from me, so that's awesome. Alright, that floor has been done. Oh, depths to- Oh, no, Curse of Darkness. Oh no, that's not good. Oh, this is like one of the worst floors for this to happen too. It's generally a dark floor anyway, like pretty dark anyways. Oh god, that sucks. At least, I can, at least the fires kind of keep things kind of lit. Oh, and, and I have like a small ball of light around me. Oh, dang it. That really sucks, kind of. It's not too bad though. Well, we should be able to manage. What did I get hit by? Oh, it was like a little pool of blood that was like, kind of hurt you blood kind of thing. Oh, God. I haven't played this in a long time, guys. I'm not sure if you guys realize that, but it's been a long time since I played this game. I took a big break. And this is my first time back, so. Because I, I realized that I hadn't recorded one of these in a while. And I wasn't done with the playthrough, definitely not. I've also known, I now know that there's like, there's the Lost that you can get, which is the one character I don't have. Oh, I got a black card out of it, nice. Yeah, so the Lost is like a secret character that do like a certain, like, like a, like a number of like, things that are very specific that you have to do to unlock it. When it's kind of like one of those things, so. Nice. Um. Yeah, let's see. Let's do this real quick. Hey, which one is an under? I think it's it's just random each time. I think. Oh, I've got it. Scout fly love, nice. I don't know what that does really, but I forgot what it does. Oh, nice. Oh. The boss. It's whatever his name is. So yeah, we're gonna be in the apartment for about like five months, I believe. Five to six months. And before our new around that's around how much time it'll be for before like our new house is ready to be lived in that oh, that helped Ooh. oh god dang it 
it's not really worth going back in there anyway to get the hearts. Or there were like two hearts. It'll be, it won't really do anything then. Oh. Oh. I forgot about those too. That those can appear. Oh, those guys were annoying to fight. Those guys are annoying to fight early on. I don't know what that does, but this this lockpick thing down in the in the bottom left, I think allows me to like open chests without needing to use a key. I think just chests though, not doors. Unless unless it's the other way around. I forgot. Oh, that was stupid. I don't know why I ran into that. Oh, see that thing's still broken. Yeah. Okay, that I saw in the last thing. We can't even use these. Um, gonna get one of these. Do I have this already? Oh, paralysis. Oh, that was stupid. Don't want that. Oh, there's the item room. Oh, oh, infamy. Oh, damage reduction. Oh, that's so good. Oh, I'm getting pretty lucky this this playthrough, guys. I'm glad I'm recording it. I'm probably gonna screw it up in the worst way possible too. I can see it coming. Oh, no way! Wait, is this range mega? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> That's not even that. This is this isn't even it. This is not even like charged up. This is charged up. Oh my god! And they still get bigger though. Normally they get smaller as they get away, but since I have Lump of Cola, it's like kind of like both. Oh, we're fighting mom now. This would be easy. Watch see how much damage I do. <laughs> oh god. I better not do that. It's dark though. I forgot to fight her in the dark. Okay, okay. She's already like halfway dead. See you later! <laughs> oh my god. Dude, this is amazing. Okay, so now I want to take the negative. Wait, let me see what's in here. Wait, what's the nail? Oh man, I'm nervous. I've never had that. I've never actually gotten the nail before. I don't know what it does. Um, This guy isn't too useful. This can let me convert real hearts into soul hearts. I'm gonna see what it does. Temporary demon form. That is cool, I guess. And I crush blocks too. Um, um, I'll take it. I feel like that's a big mistake I'm taking. I should probably keep the jump, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Let's take the negative. And now, yeah, fate chosen. Going against Satan is a is a harder boss. I will say that. Now, I don't know how long it's been, actually. Um, I'm gonna do this for though. Oh man, we're in the Utero or whatever, right? I think, or was it them, the womb? Utero one, yeah. All right. Uh. <laughs> my tear sizes, look at this! Oh my god! It's great, dude. Oh, I just have- Oh, they're all bosses now, I forgot. It's Larry Jr. It's three of them. What's the original Larry? I've never seen Larry. I don't think. Is he even in this game? Oh, two monstros! This is it, nice. I just realized I've, I'm very low on health. I am very low on health. I just died. Crap. I wasn't expecting that to happen. I wasn't paying attention to my health. Apparently it dropped a lot. Oh, I hate these enemies. I have literally have one hit until I die. Oh. This is gonna be hard, guys. Uh, now it's getting really stressful because I'm a, I have such a good item set, but... Oh, this is good too. I'm gonna use this in the meantime because they can help protect me, kind of. In a, in, in a, in a, well, kind of. They can kind of protect me.
plus I can use it a lot. Yeah! Because I kill things instantly, so these guys don't have to kill them, so I can just get a lot more of how many I have now, and I just got more. <gasps> oh, no! Oh, I came back again. 50-50 chance, baby. Oh, I thought that was the end for me there. It usually doesn't work a second time. Look how many- look, how, look, look at all these. Look how many flies I have. I have an army of them. Well, look how- am I, wait, have I turned into Guppy? I think I have. I'm floating, and I think I have the tail of Guppy. I think I got three Guppy items. Oh, it's me. Except a red version of me. Too bad my tears are so much better than those. <laughs> that would kill me right there if I did that. <gasps> oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. I thought I was gonna die there. I still have Lemon Party, but that's not gonna do much if I'm in danger. <laughs> Instant death. That'll give me 9 lives, but it'll reduce me to 1 heart. That's still good. That'll actually... That actually made my health go up. Ten lives question mark. Oh yeah, because I still have that extra one life question mark, so. Okay, that puts me a little bit more at ease. Because now I have nine certain lives. That's not like a 50-50 chance thing. The one that is. Except every time I'll start at one heart though, so. Make sure not to die, especially if I get Okay, I can't do that. Because that will kill me. I did. Okay, I have. I have damage reduction though. I feel like. That, I feel like that hasn't been really been putting into put into effect as much as it should be. I think it's. Oh no. I thought I would only be taking half hearts of damage, but I don't think that's happening. Damage reduction. Whatever. We got to do the boss now. Mama Gertie. Oh god, no. Oh my god. Did you see your health go down? <laughs> How did that happen? How did that happen? I've never taken that. Oh, it was all the flies too. Oh, that's what it was. <laughs> that's so OP. Evil up or Matt, whatever it was. Oh, okay, got all these bombs. And I got a black heart. Nice. Okay, so I have two plus hits. Question mark. Okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna. This is gonna be a mom's heart level thing. Yeah, I can fly. I am flying. So now I've got flight as well, in addition to all these cool things. Should I try this? Last time I did this, I almost died. I s whatever, I have nine months. And possibly more. Oh! I'm gonna ca I'm taking down so quickly anyway. Oh! Didn't take one bit of damage during that. Great. Got three more flies. Falls of steel. Yes! That's what I needed. That wasn't- Ah! Oh my god, that was nerve-wracking. Oh that guy started too close to me. The sun. That made a light heal and, a, and enlighten you. Okay, well, so that will heal me, I think. I think it might actually heal me to full health, which is a good thing to have, but full health is only one heart. If I get down to half a heart, I'll come back and get it. That was a boss. Look how big my tears are. What I need right now is, um, what is it called? Um, Cricket's Eye or, so or Cricket's Head or something like that. Isn't that what it is, I think? I haven't played this in so long, I don't remember. What's that? What's that? Why is it white? Oh! <gasps> An eternal heart. Oh, that's why it was white. I was like, I've never seen that. Oh, there's two of these guys. Hey, that, that was a spare. Even though I do just kill them. Like in one. Oh yeah, I should be charging it up more because I'll use my little brimstone as well. So Shoal is the next level, which is where Satan is. That is where it gets really brutal and it gets really difficult. The enemies there are really difficult. Oh, good. Oh, that was really good. I'm getting pretty fortunate again. That I got another heart. Oh man. That means I can't lose this life because when I lose this life, it'll be automatically back down to one heart again. Alright. And I don't think I'm using keys when I'm opening these chests either because I think I got the lockpicking thing. 
This is a ri and this isn't like a seed or anything, guys. Seriously, this is like legitimate. Or else it would have like um on the left here over here, it would have like a have like a no trophy like have like a trophy like a do not enter signal over it. I'm telling you, okay, I'm not doing these dice things. I can't. My items are too good. It could completely screw up the entire run for me if I do it. And my and it's not. It doesn't always screw up your items. Sometimes it does other things, but. I, I think it's random what it does, and I don't want to risk it, because that's usually what it does, it screws up your items. And sometimes it can be better, but I don't think it can get much better than this. Well, I mean, for right now, I mean, considering my luck, you know. Yeah, what's a brain or something, I don't know. Whatever it is. I haven't been everywhere, anywhere, everywhere, but there's no more item rooms either. They're gone, storing in this floor, so... I'm just gonna go for the boss. It's time to go for it lives. Oh yeah, it's not mom's heart anymore. It's it lives. Okay. <laughs> yeah. What do you want, mom? I just killed you like a couple minutes ago before you. <laughs> oh, killed already. All right. So, I'm just gonna do show real quick because it's just one floor, and then after that I beat Satan. I'll leave it off into the next episode, so then maybe I can go for uh, what's what's the next boss? Not Isaac. What is it? Is it? No, it's not the blue baby. That's something. Is it? No, it's not. I can't remember. It might be the blue baby. No, it's not. Is it really? I forgot. Wait, no, Satan is instead of Isaac, so then after that, yeah. Okay, let's do this real quick. No devil room either. So we're not going to the cathedral this time, we're going to this terrible place. Basically, hell. <laughs> and the music's crazy, it's got all these whispering in it, it's insane. So here we go, guys. Um, this is where it gets really hard. This is really hard for us. It's worse than, worse than the cathedral, in my opinion. I think it's supposed to be. And Satan is definitely a lot harder than Isaac. So, and you'll see what I mean when we fight. I'm not getting Bob's brain, sorry. That thing's, and those things are annoying. See, yeah. Those are like the cloud things, except like, they shoot like lasers though, rapidly. Good thing I killed him like, literally like right when he spawned, because I have such good items. That's the only way you'll get through this floor safely, is if you have really good items. Oh yeah, I forgot those guys shoot that. We gotta wait until he... I gotta stay in the inside. Oh, they, they don't—they don't stop either. Yep. Get up. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to go in the next floor yet. Oh, there's so many of these guys. Oh. Oh, that was—I don't know how I haven't gotten hit yet, guys. But okay, I'm not gonna do that. I want my—I want to keep my lock picking thing. Oh, those things blow up. Okay. I'm not, I'm not risking that either. There could potentially be a really good item in there, but we never. I'm not risking it. I'm not. I'm, neither am I risking that. All right. Yeah, things are going a little bit more fast-paced now. Cause oh, look at this guy. Oh, <laughs> my flies open. Haha. <laughs> yeah. See, I have things you don't. Oh, I have to. Oh, that guy. Oh. Oh. Oh, that. See, the laser hit me. Cause he shoots it so quickly. You barely have any time to react. False steel. Oh, perfect. It was a really good item to get right there. Don't, it can just fly over these. Didn't even use a key for that. Future become balanced. Oh, cool. Um, I'll come back for that heart if I ever get down to that. Hopefully I don't. That almost hit me. <gasps> oh, oh, God, this is getting... Oh, there's the boss. There's the boss. There's Sanctum. I'm not going for anything else. I'm just gonna get this over with. Time to go against Satan. So he has like three stages basically. First he spawns, um, what's it called? He spawns a different boss that you can fight other places. What is it called? I forgot what it's called. Okay, and then he splits into two. Okay, kill him. Okay, here comes Satan. This is actually Satan. Okay, so he can do like a numerous bunch of attacks. I know I'm talking very quickly. How did I kill him already? Okay, this is the hardest part right here. This is his last phase. He steps, he steps here, but it, it, he has, he spawns these idiotic things, those those black things that explode and fly at you when they see you. They're basically kind of like suicide bombers, basically. And they really interrupt you when you're trying to attack his feet. Now, since I have such good items, this will be pretty easy to kill him, actually. Got his, get his feet. Yes! 
There we go. There's, and that's Satan dead. All right. So that was quick. I don't know how long this episode's been, but I'm going to end it there anyway. Now, I forgot what I want to do. I think if I go here, we will end up in the chest. I mean, no, not the chest, the dark room. Wait, I haven't been this far in any of my playthroughs yet, have I? Oh, nope, dark room. Okay, so this is, this is what happens, guys. This is like the final area of the game. If I had collected the key pieces from going to angel rooms and fighting the angel, I could have gotten two key pieces from fighting two angels and would have equaled, and it would have like, it would have equal, and then would have been able to open this. And there is where we'd have been able to fight um, uh, Mega Satan, I think, which is the final boss, of the, the hardest boss of the game by far, and it's insane. But it's really hard to even get the key pieces to even be able to fight him. I have beaten him before, once, I think. And it was on my first try, actually, but it was close. And it's it's really scary, but I won't be able to do that in this. Okay, at the end of this, I'll be, I'll be fighting the lamb. If you went to if you went to the cathedral after you beat Isaac, you would you would enter the chest and you would be and you would go to the area called the chest. Which instead of these these four red chests, oh, that was actually something good. It would be like like four locked chests, which is a lot better. Oh no. Oh, this shovel will dig a hole the next floor, but there aren't any other floors, so I don't know what the point of that is. I'll use this. I get this, I guess. Infested friend. Cool. Thanks, devil. All right. Oh, please be good. Oh, that's not good. I found. I don't know what that does. I don't know what I found pills does. Yo, I'll give you a little sneak peek. Every single room has a boss in it, basically. Oh, no, those aren't bosses. I don't know what that is, why that's there. But this one should have. Yep, see, that's a big boss. There's a boss in every room, and actually most of the rooms, have, they have multiple bosses. They have multiple of the same boss. But yeah, so I'm going to continue this in the next episode, because I'm probably not going to play this on my own in between. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. In the next episode of The Binding of Isaac Rebirth, where I take on the dark room and eventually get to the lamb and end the game there.